In this video, I'll show you how to add or remove soft subtitles from a video using Subtitle Edit. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, soft subtitles are subtitles you can turn on or off in a video. These subtitles are not banned in, but they are part of the video but as an embedded option. So, I'm using the latest version of Subtitle Edit and this is Subtitle Edit 3.6.12. This is uh, where we have this new feature and it is a highly welcome feature. Soft subtitles can be played or maybe let's say a, a player like VLC Media Player. Uh, maybe you wanted to watch a movie or maybe you wanted to watch a video uh, that subtitles can be turned on or off. So let's go to video and open a video and the video that I'm going to be working with, I do have a ton of subtitles to this particular video. Now, different languages ETC. So I'll click on open. It's going to open up and then I'll go to video and then the new option generate video with added or removed embedded subtitles. More or less it's generate a video with embedded subtitles but you can always use it to add or remove embedded subtitles and I'll show you in this video how to do both of those actions. So click on generate video with added or remove subtitles whatever and then click on add. This is the only active option and the generate but let's click on add. And then from this page uh, that I do have a couple of subtitles to, I'll just click on it and then I can get a couple of subtitles that I have. I believe it's English, Farsi, Portuguese, Arabic, Italian. So click on open. Yeah. So this is what it got English, Persian, Portuguese, Arabic, Italian. Now from this section, you'll be able to see the format of that particular subtitle. And at the time of recording this video, subrip and ASSA subtitles are supported in Subtitle Edit 3.6.12. Next up, we've got the language. It has detected that the language of the subtitles uh, because they do have the extension for the language. And then there's this option for default or forced and then the file name. If I click on any subtitle, you have the options to remove, remove all, move up, move down, toggle forced, toggle default, or even set language. So if this first subtitle does not have a language and you know it's an English subtitle, you can always click on set language and then choose from the list which language this particular subtitle is in. But because I already know it's in English, I'll just have it selected and not set a language. The only thing I'll do here is I'll toggle default. When I click that, this changes to true. The reason why I've done that is to make sure that once our subtitles are embedded to the video, that the English subtitles will come up instantly. You don't need to keep selecting, but the rest will just be available for you to select whenever you want. Now, once you're satisfied, click on generate. Once you click on generate, navigate to the folder where you want to save the subtitles. I'll just save them here. And then you can choose a file name, but I'll leave them as it is. Uh, and then underscore embedded. And then there's a save as type. Now, I'll go for Matroska, but we also have WebM and MP4. I've noticed that when you embed soft subtitles in the MP4, they're not highly supported even if you have set this particular true uh, option uh, available for the default. So I'll choose Matroska and then click on save. And the subtitles have been embedded. There's no burning in here. And that is why this particular process is super, super fast. So I'll open containing folder and we'll navigate to that folder so that we can appreciate the result. So if I just double click on this video, pause it, I've paused it and right click inside, click on subtitle. You can add a subtitle, but there's also the subtitle track down here. You can disable, but you see by default, it is set to English. What we said in a previous, uh, just a couple of seconds ago, we also have the Persian, Portuguese, Arabic, and Italian. We've now embedded the subtitles to the video. So if we actually play with the recent update on the YouTube interface, you'll now see the subtitles play as they need to be. If you'd like to change that to a different language, you come back here, just select, let's say Italian, play. It's now easier than before to download YouTube transcripts. Hi, my name is David from freelancerinsights. It takes us uh, some time before it recognizes but they are there. So it's because I'm playing. If I started from the beginning, it would be available right there and then. So this looks really good and it's highly welcome because 
we don't need to use X number of applications or softwares to do all this. Now, because we've already watched how we can actually add the soft subtitles to the video, I'll show you how to remove them. It's also super easy. I'll click on File, New, and then to remove, I'll just click on Video, Generate Video with Added or Removed Embedded Subtitles, click on that. And then from this section, you can input the video you want. So I'll click on this and then go to the video I just added the soft subtitles to, click on that, and then click on Open. Once I do that, you'll see your subtitles here, English, Persian ETC. So I'll just select all of them and click on Remove All. If you'd like to just remove a couple, you can also do that. But I'll just select and just click on Remove All and then Generate. Generate video without any embedded subs. Yes. Let's call it Without and click on Save. Let's navigate to the folder. Let's look at it again. If I double click on it, pause it, right click, subtitle, there are no subtitle tracks to this video. We have successfully embedded soft subtitles and successfully removed soft subtitles from our video. I hope that this tutorial has been of value to you. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, stay safe and never stop learning. Thanks for watching.